Hey, hi, how's it going? It's Mark here. Thanks for uh, scanning the code in the High Country News article and finding me here on my YouTube channel. Uh, today I want to talk to you about QR codes. I'll try and keep it as short as I can, but those of you who know me, you know I can uh, ramble on a bit. Anyways, so back to QR codes and how can they help build your brand, help with your business. I'll give you five good reasons on, uh, I'm, I'm sure there are more, but I'll give you five of my own and uh, we'll discuss them. But first, let me tell you a little bit about QR codes. So QR code, what is that? Well, QR stands for quick response. We're all familiar familiar with barcodes that we see on products, those, those vertical lines with numbers underneath. Well, a QR code goes a step beyond that in that it gives you much more data, it's much faster, and it's not just with the product you're holding in hand. It goes, takes you to websites, to coupons, all these types of things. Hence, uh, that's why they're called quick response. So they're a little bit better than product barcodes, but let's talk about it more. So QR codes were invented by uh, an engineer by the name of Masahiro Hara in 1994, an engineer, and he created these to track auto parts. So I think he worked for uh, a Dentsu Waver, a company that is associated with Toyota. Anyways, he wanted to make sure that uh, components that got shipped around the world were trackable. He based his invention on a game called Go, and it's a it's a it's like the world's oldest board game. It's with these little black and white circular discs, and you place. I don't. I'm not going to get into that, but that's where he got his inspiration to create a QR code. So. Um, yeah, let me, I won't ramble more about the game, but let's get back to QR codes. Well, here in North America, anyways, we got familiarized with them during COVID. So the medical industry used QR codes to track and book uh, COVID testing. And that's what they were used for. We got more familiarized, those of us who weren't in the medical field, when post COVID or when we went to restaurants where you didn't want to touch things because of germs and spreading shit like that. You would sit down at your table and there in the middle of the table was a QR code and with instructions saying, place your smartphone over the QR code. When that little bar comes up, you hit that with your finger like you would take in a picture and up, up, up would pop the restaurant's menu. So that's how we started getting more familiarized with them. Personally, in the advertising design business, they've been around for a while, but back in the well, not back in the day, but not long before they became more familiar, you had to have a, a application that had to would scan this QR code. So it wasn't as simple as just taking your phone, clicking, and getting to the the uh, website or whatever. You had to actually have an app. So it was cumbersome back then. But now we're so used to seeing them every day. They're everywhere. So you know, when I talk about business cards and and where you can use QR codes, there's my business card. I've got my corporate logo on one side and on the back is a QR code. And actually, if you look closely, there's also my little smiley face logo. But around it, I have my phone number, email address. But someone who receives my business card will scan it and end up at my website. And what they'll see there is what Ad Mackey does. They can see who works there, what type of work we're doing. And again, they don't have to memorize a URL. So that's very, very simple for potential customers. And you can do that with your business. So make sure you have a URL on your business card. I'd never say that five years ago because they're just personally kind of jump in your face or kind of get in the way. They're an ugly design element, but they are functional and serve a purpose. So that's a good thing. Which reminds me, uh, yesterday, Kate and I were presenting some concepts to a client and during the meeting we were interrupted by one of his contractors and this contractor I learned happened to have his own business him and his wife were starting a business and uh, he needed help to do some stuff actually today so I volunteered my services I can I said I can come back and give you a hand if you need something because he had to lift something heavy and so I presented him with my business card and he first off you know he looked at it because he goes geez, that's a, that's a round business card. I said, well, just, and I said to him, just scan the uh, QR code and, and you get all my information. My, you'll be able to contact me. And he kind of gave me that puzzled look. He goes, I don't know how to use one of those things. And he's probably, you know, probably in his fifties. And I said, simple, just grab your smartphone, hold it over the QR code and a little bar will pop out and you hit that and it'll take you to a website. And he did it. And I was like, holy shit wow, this really works. And I said, yeah, well, you know, you should uh, be using one for your own business, your your 
your handyman business. So anyways, the guy left and within a minute, he comes back through the door, presents me with his business card. And uh, he says, here's my business card. I'm old school, but you know, my wife runs the business, blah, blah, blah. And I'm looking at his business card and sure enough, <laughs> I look at it and go, you have a business card with a QR code on it. And he's like, he was totally dumbfounded to go, what? I said, yeah, good. Your wife is smart because uh, you need to have one on your business card these days. It's a quick and easy way to find your website and, and, and validate what you say or do. So just a little tip there, you know, doesn't hurt to have it there. So before this video gets way too long, I just want to say, you know, at the beginning, I said I'd give you five reasons why you should be using a QR code. I'm sure there are a lot more, but these are kind of the ones I keep in my brain when I, when I am considering using a QR code in an ad or something. One of the benefits of a QR code is that you get instant engagement. Like I said, I presented this business card to this fellow yesterday and immediately he scanned it and goes, holy shit, now I know what you do. You're an advertising branding guy so yeah so instant engagement and again if you're a business owner and you have a an event coming up a sale coming up a campaign give people the qr code you know you can offer them a percent back when they scan it so if they scan it they'll take you to your website and you can have a coupon code or something that says hey get 25 percent off because you found your way here things like that so you can really talk to people who are who are your potential customers or current customers uh, number two it's trackable so you can see just by like computers when, you know, websites, how many people come and visit, that kind of stuff. Same thing with the QR code. You're essentially, it's a URL that you're giving them and it'll take them to your homepage or a specific page in your website or, or your social media site like I'm doing right now, taking you to my YouTube site, things like that. You can count and track what um, people do. And even when they get to your website, you can see how long they spend on whatever pages, you know, that's called the bounce back, but I'm not going to get into that either because it's way over my head. Anyways. Yeah. So things like that. So first instant engagement. Second, it's trackable. Third, it's versatile. Like I mentioned earlier, you can slap it on your forehead. You can slap it in the sky with drones. You can carve it into a field. I don't know if you can use it on water yet. Hmm. Uh, you can, you know, put it on your products. You can put it anywhere to, to, keep in touch with your clients as long as they scan it and find a reason to scan it. So, um, yeah, so great way to reach potential audience or attract and keep your current ones. Um, number four, they're cost effective. All you, they're easy to design, get your advertising agency to create one for you and, and focus it on a particular, um, location on your website or social media or whatever. So I mean, obviously you can't use it for social media because you need your camera to watch social media and you can't take a picture of a QR code while you're, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, anyways, okay. And finally, number five, you know, to potential customers and people you interact with, it just shows them that you're up to date on the latest marketing technology, things like that. Um, you know, you're not cold calling people. You know, maybe you're you're doing something a little more creative and, and certainly with a QR code, you can... Like what I'm doing here, I'm trying to do, use an article that I write, but instead get you to use a QR code, see this video, and get bored to death by me mumbling on and on. Anyways, that's how QR codes work. If you want more information, give myself or my team a call. We'd be more than happy to, blah, 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 happy to chat with you. And always use a professional because you'll save time, money, and you'll get more bang for your buck than trying to do it yourself. My own personal opinion, but hey, you know what? Got to put food on the dog table anyways take care mark out from behind the wall wall behind the wheel of the red jeep and hey if you're really really bored and want to hear me spew on about all kinds of weird stuff everything from golf oh speaking of golf see look at i just ordered my own uh customized golf balls from vice and you'll see here that they've got my my little caricature on there. I don't know if you can see that. Miyagi, that's my nickname. But yeah, so next time I go to order Vice Golf Balls, because there's a QR code on the box, I just have to scan that and say, hey, I need to order another five dozen because I lost the last five dozen playing the last two rounds. I suck at golf. Anyways, okay, enough about me rambling on. Take care, have a great time. And if you need some business marketing, creative advice, please do not hesitate to scan our code. Mark out. Take care. Bye-bye.